Hey you guys, I am here with another unboxing. This is Mary with Mary Making Crafts. Let's take a look at Seahorse by Marjorie Sarnat. This is a Diamond Art Club kit. This is 56 by 74 centimeters. I call this Diamond Art Club sweet spot. Um, it is their most popular size. This is a square diamond kit and I am really excited about the colors in this one. <laughs> and I can't find my scissors, yes, okay. So, um, I had actually seen my friend Bree over at Painting with Pities working on this kit, and I had it on my wish list, and I couldn't decide to, whether or not I wanted to get it, and she kept working on it, and I kept looking at it, and I kept saying, no, I'm not going to get it. Yeah, I'm going to get it. No, I'm not. So finally, I decided to go ahead. Oh my goodness, I am struggling with this today. I don't even know. I guess we don't have to take it off, do we? It's the satisfying piece, though. I have to. Okay. So, um, yeah. And I kept going back and forth. Like, do I want to? Um, so, I did decide to do it. And I'm excited to take a look. So, we have our small sticker. And you can use this for your logbook, absolutely. But I like to go ahead and peel these off and stick them right there on the top of my box because I store my kits upright. So we have that. And then we have the old toolkit. So these are just some loose baggies. We have tweezers since this is a square kit, your wax, your tray, your pen and squishy, just your average kit. <laughs> so no fun extras in this one. But we will go ahead and pull out this canvas. We have our Diamond Art Club canvas. It's beautiful in our bag. And of course, oh, that one was easy. Sometimes they're not. <laughs> so, oh, the colors in this kit are what got me. So I used to buy kits that I would decorate with, and now I buy kits that I think I'll enjoy working on. Um, because I learned that different colors make me happy, like <laughs> being able to switch between colors. So, um, yeah, I do them just purely for fun now and not just to decorate, but you have your little insert with instructions and a thank you code. And I like to use this for my logbook. You have your start and end date and a larger image of that beautiful artwork. This one just, it sings beach to me and I love it. Um, you have individual stickers for kitting up, um, which is really nice that those are already cut for you. Uh, this kit is 26 colors, and three of those are ABs. If you're not familiar with ABs, those are just Aurora Borealis gems. Uh, they have just a special sparkly iridescent coating on them. Anything that is under 150 for Diamond Art Club is an AB drill. So we have three of those in this kit. It looks like a pink, a, a orange, and a white. So we will take a look at those soon. We have some beautiful, beautiful colors. <laughs> Just gorgeous. The purple, oh my gosh. Can't wait to take a look at this one. But let's look at the canvas, shall we? Uh, it's so pretty. And of course, it always unrolls so nicely. And I barely have to do anything to make it lay flat. Oh my gosh, this is beautiful. It's beautiful. <sighs> that is a pretty kit. So what I liked about this kit was um, just kind of the opportunity to do some color blocking. Um, and then that center there looks a little confetti, but not bad. Um, there's definitely a lot of color blocking in that. I was calling it purple, but that's actually blue. Um, yeah, there's definitely a lot of color blocking here, so that'll take a, a minute or two. <laughs> but it is cool that it only has 26 colors. Um, I feel like, for me, I feel like this will work out pretty fast. I know, I don't know that Brie had the best time working on this kit, but I definitely think I will. Um, I can't wait to do this one, it's so pretty. 
I know, I say it, I do. I say it about every kit that I open. I'm like, I can't wait to do it. But I, it's so true, I, I really can't. Um, anyway, I like think about all of the paintings in my kit, like in my kit, in my stash all the time. And I'm like, I'm, how am I ever gonna get to all of these beautiful paintings? How, how, I'm never gonna get to all of them because I have to work. If I didn't have to work, I could get to all my paintings. Anyway, <laughs> I digress. So let's take a look at some drills. All right, y'all, we are starting off strong here with seven bags of 310. That is our black. Um, when I look at this kit, I would never have guessed seven bags of 310. I'm like shocked. But now I understand it because it outlines pretty much everything you see. So yeah, seven bags of 310. <laughs> we have five bags of 796. That's that really pretty cobalt blue it's so beautiful um this one doesn't surprise me because there is a ton a ton a ton of color blocking of this color we have three bags of 3841 that light blue and that's kind of your secondary background color basically that's around the shelves uh 754 and two bags of 3078 we have three bags of 3854 one bag of 720 and one bag of 995. 351, 598, our first AB, that 132, that pretty orange. Two bags of 352 and 720. And I think, yeah, we did. We had another bag of the 720, so there's two of those. One bag of 3607 and 3608. 992. 900, 3325, 955, and our next AB, that's 141, our white AB. And last strand, little tiny bits of 917, 597, our third AB, that pink one, 124, 993, 3760, 743, and 954. All right, you guys, let's take a look at our first AB. This one is 124, it's our little pink. And this one is number one on our canvas. I will just bring this up and show you. These are gonna be in these two shells here and here at the top of those two pink shells. And then we have number two, that is our orange AB. We have quite a bit of this one actually. 132 and this one I'll start here at the bottom that is number two on the schematic it really highlights all of the um, curves in that shell and its corresponding shell on the other side it's kind of sprinkled throughout some of these little details here um, as we move up toward this center box it's kind of here it's in the seahorse's tail and sprinkled throughout the seahorse a little bit here and here. So it's really, it's kind of all over. And then we also have it highlighting up here um, some of the curves in this shell and the outlines of the outside shells. So it's kind of all over, it's a, it's a heavy one. And then our last AB is this one. This is our white AB, 141. And this one is sprinkled uh, in all of the bubbles that you see on the canvas. So there's bubbles like here in the corner and that white highlights those bubbles. So it's also the center of the seahorse's eyes. Um, sorry, I just realized you can see that. Those bubbles, these bubbles, and then in the corner. Um, so it's also the center, like I said, of the seahorse's eye. And that is all of the threes that I see, the whites. Yeah. That is Seahorse. I hope you enjoyed this video and uh, let me know if there are any others from the stash video that you really want to see. Um, I put out whip and chats every week and a daily vlog so you can keep up with my progress. Uh, I would love to have you here uh, if you want to just hit that subscribe button so you don't miss any of the daily vlogs. 
And uh, yeah, I would love to hang out with you. Uh, I am going to be starting a live series very, very soon uh, with my friend Bree. So I am hoping that you will come and join us for that. And um, yeah, uh, I will link Bree's channel uh, also in the description of this video uh, because she is the one that inspired me. But I was like, I have to get this kit. So yeah, and uh, we're friends. So <laughs> Anyway, I uh, hope you have a great day when you're watching this, and uh, I'll see you soon. Bye!